a very good quality and with a special aroma because of the biodiversity uh, here in Kefalonia. And um, because of the animals, we, we have uh, mostly on the island goats and the uh, sheep. Um, because as you see, we have many mountains. Goats can survive in mountains. They are very good climbers. And because of the animals, uh, we produce our meal, our milk, uh, yes, our yogurt, and our feta cheese. Uh, we don't have many cows because cows need valleys, and as you will see, we don't have many valleys in Kefalonia. The feta cheese of Kefalonia is one of the best in Greece. Uh, we have a long tradition in cheese making, and this is why uh, the cheese makers of the island used to travel to Italy and to the Balkans to work in factories there. Uh, feta cheese is made of milk of sheep and goat, and although it's very tasty, it is uh, very bad for cholesterol. For you it's not a problem because you don't have it every day, but in the Greek table, every day, there is feta cheese. The word feta is of Italian origin. It was used uh, when the Italians tried to describe this cheese, which was served in slices. They used the word feta, which meant in Italian slice, and then the word got uh, a Greekified in a way, and now the cheese is called feta. Another important traditional product of Kefalonia is the wine. Uh, at the interior of uh, the island there are uh, some vineyards and uh, they belong to the variety called Robola. This variety of grapes grows only here in Kefalonia. So uh, the Robola grapes give us uh, our wine called again Robola. It is dry and uh, white. It has a protected name of origin exactly because it can now. be produced only here. Can be produced only here. And there is a cooperation under the same name uh, that has approximately 300 members. And uh, there we do the production, the bottling, the branding, and the exportation of our local wine. Imagine it is very uh, important for a small island like ours to have its own exclusive product. Our wine has been exported abroad uh, to many European countries, to the United States. And uh, if you want to know more about it, uh, you can also Google it. It's Robola of Kefalani. Robola. Ebola is not working. The disease. Frito. Frito, right? The best. the 80s, when tourism began to evolve on this island, uh, many uh, people, especially young people, uh, preferred not to, to work uh, in the traditional uh, professions anymore. Uh, the life of a chef or an agricultural, as you can imagine, it's uh, very difficult. So, uh, slowly, but uh, steadily, that is, uh, there was a, a change in our society, more and more people started working in tourism and nowadays tourism has become the primary economical resource of uh, our island. Uh, families invest a lot uh, in uh, tourism. Imagine that the children here learn to speak uh, English from uh, a very, uh, very early at um, at the age of six or seven years old, they start learning English, and then uh, a second language is added, mostly Spanish, uh, Italian, German, or French. Uh, children here are at least bilingual. Other families have constructed small studios uh, to let or small uh, souvenir shops, family restaurants and uh, tavernas. The restaurant that we're going to visit together today, Tassia, uh, it's a very uh, famous restaurant in uh, Fiscardo, uh, but uh, it is a, a family business. It started as a family restaurant and it's still uh, run by a single Kefalonian family. Yeah. 
special? Because of uh, tourism, the island of Kefalonia uh, doesn't uh, experience uh, unemployment, which is a, a big problem in the Greek mainland. From uh, tourism, uh, Kefalonians uh, work in uh, the public uh, sector, that is for uh, the Greek state, and also in the private sector. We have all the professions here necessary uh, to have an organized and independent life, that is that we don't need to travel to the mainland uh, to get uh, many kinds of services, like there is medical services, for example, there is a municipal hospital uh, on uh, the island. And uh, imagine that in uh, Argostoli, the capital, there is everything that one can find in uh, 